24 hours since it was reported in the media that the more than 500 tobacco growers from across the country had been stranded at the Tobacco Association of Zambia. Till now, they are still here. But this is tobacco, only here. And if they don't buy my tobacco, am I going to smoke my tobacco? Indeed, this is the only place to sell. And if a definite solution is not found, this tobacco lying here is likely to go to waste. The tobacco traders are aggrieved at what they term failure by the Tobacco Association of Zambia to buy their produce. These people refuse to buy our tobacco. We have got nowhere to take them. Okay. They have to think of us. We are really farmers. Some let the government, the let, the, let, let, let the government come in. Some of us got the money from Youth Empowerment Fund and we invested the money in farming. And when are we, what, what, how are we going to sell if they're, going, they're not going to buy us? We need them to buy us. And they are saying they are going to open the market in six weeks sure. time. They are not sure. They are not giving us a, a proper insurance to say they are going to buy our tobacco when or when. They are saying they are going to inform us. They are going to send us text. But the association has emphasized that they are not buying any tobacco from independent farmers as the market is not ready. Uh, is a free market commodity. And uh, what we understand is the orders have been reduced for Zambia for this year, as has been an oversupply. We've had two very good years, and it seems at the moment there's a bit of a contraction in the market. So we have to wait for the merchants to make, get their orders and to make sure that they are in a position to commit to what they want to buy, that they can sell it. However, the time within which the market will be ready has not been determined. Meanwhile, the farmers whose livelihood is dependent on tobacco growing will have to continue wallowing in poverty despite their contribution to the economy being undoubtedly significant. The general manager, Albert Van Vick, says transport allowance of 300 kwacha is being allocated for the traders to ferry them to their respective areas. It seems an agreement has not yet been met between the Association of Zambia and the traders. Cecilia Kaya, Movie TV News, in Lusaka.